Welcome to Food Trends TV. I am Everyday Innovator Dana McCauley. Today we're talking about juicing. Juicing has been around for a while as a uh, health-based food trend and it is continuing to grow and do really interesting things. There are tons and tons of companies trying to get into this space or stay in this space and that means that they're having to really position themselves against very, very narrow niches. So you're seeing um, cold pressed juices become very popular. They are apparently healthier because the uh, vegetables haven't been oxidized and the fruits have been oxidized when they are processed and therefore they're more nutrient rich. You're seeing things like uh, activated charcoal, which is used to treat people who've been poisoned in emergency rooms, being added to uh, detox uh, smoothies and, and juice blends in, in some places. And you're seeing kind of some focus focus. You're seeing uh, uh, juices that are formulated to match your astrological sign and others that are um, formulated to represent the Chinese five elements. Well, I think this is all super interesting and someone like me loves to watch it. Uh, I think what it really signals is that this is an industry that is going to contract soon. There's too many players and basically, you know, the tried and true is going to rise to the top. I don't think that astrological smoothies are going to sweep the nation anytime soon is what I'm really trying to say. That's what's going on with juicing. What I want to know from you in the comment section below is um, how have your juice habits changed? Are you still just like a glass of OJ person in the morning like a lot of people I know? Or are you integrating juicing uh, as supplementary and snack foods to enhance your health? Thanks very much. I am really pleased you watched and I hope you'll subscribe so that you don't miss the next episode.